So if you have started SIP in phone pay application, but for some reason you want to cancel it or you want to stop it, but you don't know the procedure, then this video is for you. I'm going to guide you through each and every step. But before that, if you're new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Let's start the video. So the very first thing you have to do is just simply open phone pay application in your mobile phone and complete the login process. It doesn't matter if you're using an iPhone or an Android phone, the process is going to be same. Once the application is completely started on the home page itself, go down and look for mutual fund option. Select mutual fund and over here you can check out your portfolio. If you select your portfolio, you can check out the invested amount, you can check out the profit. If there is any profit, this option will be in green and you can check out basic details over here. You can also check out the invested funds. In my case, I have only invested in one particular fund. Now, if you go to my orders, you can check out your SIP over here. But if you want to cancel SIP, then in that case, you need to select my SIP option. Now, once you go to my SIP, if you have invested in multiple SIPs or in multiple funds, you can check out all the options over here. As I said, I have uh, only in invested in one particular fund. Now, you have to select only that particular SIP which you want to cancel. So select that SIP and once you select it on the next page, you get multiple options. You can check out the amount, you can check out the frequency. If you want to modify the details instead of canceling out the SIP, then you can modify. Like I can, uh, you know, change the amount. I can, let's uh, enter the OTP first and let's go ahead and let me show you. You can change the SIP amount. You can also uh, change the date for installment. So if you want to do basic uh, modification, you can select modify option over here. If you want to skip the next installment instead of cancel, uh, canceling out the SIP, then you can skip next installment as well. I have already made a dedicated video on that. You can go and check it out later. But as I said, if you want to cancel the SIP completely, you have delete SIP option over here at the bottom. So select delete SIP on the next page. Uh, you, need to, uh, you need to select the reason why you want to stop or why you want to cancel the SIP. Now after selecting the reason, select proceed option. You will get a pop-up screen like this. If you want to delete the SIP, select delete this SIP option and again it will show you a pop-up screen. Uh, this is the final step. Before cancelling the SIP, keep one thing in mind that we are only cancelling the SIP. So the SIP will be stopped but the uh, invested amount will be as it is. In order to remove the invested amount, uh, you have to uh, do it separately. You need to redeem the amount separately. So I'm going to make a dedicated video on that as well. Currently, we are only cancelling the SIP. So select delete option. Now you can see SIP is gone. So if I go back and if I go in my SIP, you can see it is not displaying my SIP because it is cancelled. Now if I go back and again if I select my portfolio option, if you want to withdraw or redeem the amount which you have invested, then in that case you just need to select this invested fund option and over, over here you can just check out withdraw option. So yeah, this is how simple it is to cancel or stop SIP in phone pay application. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.